Hi, it's Adrian. How are you today? And so I'm back with some Undone Beauty. And so I thought I'd show you what I have on. And uh, I have an, um, it's a brand that I found about two years ago. And it's on uh, Ulta. It's on the website. I don't think it's in stores, but um, they have a lot of fun products. And I found a couple of colors that I thought were pretty neat. So decided to go ahead and film the look. And so um, I started out with the uh, let's see, the Glow Oil by Supergoop, and then I added in the Terra 28, and this is the Sunny Days. Um, I have mine in Melrose, so that's what I have on there. I did go ahead and add in the Incognito Concealer, and this one is by Wet n Wild. And then um, as far as what I did on the cheeks, I used the Sunset Bronzer by Undone Beauty. And so I used the entire palette. Um, I used this color down um, where bronzer is. I have some bronzer on as well, but I went ahead and used this where you put your bronzer. Use this one as the actual blush. Mix these two together uh, to go ahead and do the highlighter. And I did go ahead and add in a little bit of the Revlon um, Daybreak in 201 as well. So I have both of these on there. And then as far as what I did for the bronzer today, got the Made by Mitchell, the Curve Case. And I went ahead and used uh, this one as my bronzer today. And it's a cream bronzer. It works real well. As far as what I did on the eyes, that's going to be Undone Beauty 2. And I did go ahead and use the Essence Thick and Wow. Uh, for the brow and then the Essence uh, Volume Stylist and this is 18 hour wear. It's a 2B mascara for the mascara and uh, went ahead and used the Gel Eyeliner by Colourpop and this one is in brown. Had um, two different uh, palettes from um, Undone Beauty. Uh, this is the Curator Eye Palette in 710 Bare. So that's what it looks like. And then I also use the Undone Beauty um, Eye Quad. This one is about last night. And this one has a beautiful duochrome shade in it. This one right here goes gold to pink and is just, um, if you want to do a one done. Uh, look, this shade would be one of those shades to do that with. I also used a little bit of this gray color in um, the crease as well. But this is what I mainly have on the lid is this color right here. I did use a couple of other colors from, like I said, the 710 Bear palette. And so I did go ahead and use the white over here as an inner corner highlight. I also took it from here up to here and then here over to here. So it's right underneath the brow is a brow highlight and it's also on the inner corner and that's the white. Uh, these two shades and they're kind of hard to see. I don't know. Well, that's a little bit better. Um, but the two shades right next to the white are a pink and a mauve. And I sort of mix those and put those um, on the outer corner. And then, like I said, right in the crease, I did go ahead and put the gray from the um, That Last Night palette. I think I'll go ahead and put a little bit more gray in there. Let's see if we can go ahead and get a little bit more. So, yeah, that gives it a little bit more depth. It was kind of turning out sort of to be, um, yeah, an all, all gold look, and that actually added in a little bit more depth. This is the way that the eye look turned out. And again, I think the eye, the Undone uh, Beauty is a really, it's, it's a good line. Um, I like the way that they've done these, uh, where they've gone ahead and done the 4-in-1 uh, bronzer palette so that you have everything that you need to do for a sun-kissed bronzer. And this has always been one of my favorites. Uh, the eyeshadows are okay. They're actually a really different formula. And I think they may work better for a one-and-done look um, than... Uh, 
it's a different formula. The um, it's powdery, but it has a lot of translucence to it. So it's going to go ahead and yeah, it's definitely there. I can see it. Um, it just it's more of a translucent kind of shade, and so I think they're really pretty. Um, they may be, like I said, better for a one and done look. And then I also have uh, this one. It's the Nonser palette. This is their highlighting palette. And I've gotten a lot of use out of this, and I think it's really pretty as well. And I really like their packaging. Um, it's very sturdy, um, and it's it's pretty compact. I mean, it's a good line. It's over at Ulta, and like I said, I've really enjoyed the products. The eyeshadows are actually new to me, and I guess that's why I'm a little bit like, well, I'm not quite sure because I really haven't played with them. They kind of got put... Um, I got them um, over at Ulta a little while ago, and I just didn't have anything planned with them. Um, so I want to go ahead and work with them some more. Um, like I said, they have a very translucent quality to them, so they may actually work really good for an everyday kind of one and done look. Is the way I'm leaning with them right now, but. Um, like I said, I'm having fun playing, and I will get back to you on my thoughts because, like I said, the eyeshadows are brand new to me, and I haven't really had a time to wear them a couple of times to find out how I like them. Um, other than that, with the lips, I did go ahead and use the My Type, and that one is by Too Faced. It's a melted matte. It's an older one. And then I did go ahead and use the Baby Gloss. And this one is one in Glam by Relove Revolution. So that's the way that the lip kind of came out today. And um, yeah, there's a whole lot of gold shimmer going on in this look. And I think it turned out kind of fun. And it was definitely something different and interesting to do during an afternoon. So, um, like I said, the products that I really like from Undone are going to be uh, this bronzer and their highlighters. And um, really like these products. They also had uh, the, oh, what's the other one that I had? Uh, the face tint. And so I really like that one during the summer. Um, really like these two, and I'm still playing with the eyeshadows right now. But so far, a uh, little bit different kind of uh, approach and different kind of formula. So I'll let you know on these. And um, I think that's about all the video for today. And I hope that you have a great holiday, and I'll see you later. Bye.